sirens could be heard up and down Campbellsville Street in Liberty from sunrise through the noon hours. Volunteer firefighters brought water trying to fight a blaze at the Goose Creek Candle Company. There is numerous people that are going to be out of work. Terry Cochran is one of about 70 people who works at the candle factory. They make them from start to finish. I mean, from it goes in the jar to I ship it out the back door. Cochran came over to rescue one of the few surviving candles from the factory. We're told that no one was inside the candle factory when the fire started and no one was injured. But among the first to run into the building to make sure that nobody was inside were folks from the Casey County EMS Center located conveniently right next door to the candle factory. Terry Cochran also works there as an EMT. It is. It's a family. I mean, that's what we are. We're all a family. Liberty is sure to be affected by this fire, say community members, because not only did this factory employ people, it served local businesses. We own a, a local store up the street um, called Southern Charm, but we buy a lot of our candles, we buy all of our candles from here. Nikki Atwood describes Goose Creek Candle as a local company with connections across the country. Micah just got back from what I hear from like Boston on a, a business trip. Um, they distribute to Marshalls, they distribute to Myers, they distribute to Gordman's. The owners declined to elaborate or speculate on just how much property was damaged, but did say they hope to rebuild. Covering the news in Casey County, Adam Weiner, LEXAT News.